Sarah from Sai Let's Play, and today we are going to be playing Girlfriend's Guide to Freedom, or AKA Breakup. So I'm assuming today we are going to experience a very sad heartbreak, but we are going to show that we can still be a strong, independent woman that doesn't need a relationship to be happy. So let's go ahead and get into it. See, I told you it was breakup. See, I was like, freedom! <laughs> oh, here we go. All right. When Lisa first saw Jack, he was playing quarterback in the final game. Aww. The first one she had watched, she transferred to this new school. So basically, what was it? Like, first love? Love at first sight? Lucky for her, Jack was her classmate. He was also very handsome and charming. So did he have it all? Did Mr. Jack have it all? I think he did. All right, let's see. After two months, Lisa confessed her feelings to Jack. And you know what? What? Like all good love stories, Jack liked her too. <gasps> oh, so they were, they just fell in love. Okay, all right. Oh, is she making him birthday presents now or birthday cakes? For Jack's birthday today, Lisa prepared a birthday cake as a surprise. However, there's a big surprise waiting for her. Oh, do not tell me this man cheated on her. He cheated on her, didn't he? I'm going to be so mad. Look, I'm already, I'm already mad for Lisa. Lisa's, okay, first day needs a cake. Really? Okay, so that's the rule number one. First day needs a cake. Really? So we're going to be making a cake, I guess. I'm Lisa. Today is my world's cutest boyfriend, Jack's birthday. That was a mouthful. <laughs> He's a football player on our school team. Okay. Oh, you wearing his shirt, girl? Oh my gosh. I baked the cake for him already. Okay, where is it? It's time for me to change my clothes now. Don't want to be late. Okay, we'll make sure you aren't late. Don't worry. You got that dirty making the cake? Or I hope you weren't that dirty when you were making the cake. Because then what if like some of the dirt fell onto the cake? That's a bit nasty. Clean, clean, all right. clean. Let's clean up your face. Scrubby, scrubby. Get all the dirt off. Make sure you look so fresh and so clean. Get all that. Oh my gosh. Seriously, this girl is like so pretty. Okay, let's get this off at the top. I don't know why Jack would ever cheat My on you. Like Alright, there we go. Get the rest off over here. Perfect. <laughs> Put your Jack shirt on. <laughs> it says love as well. You know what? You are a devoted girlfriend. Alright, let's... Color should I pick? Let's pick your lipstick color. Mm, oh, we got different brands as well. So let's try... That's a nice one. It's like a bit of an orangey. Don't really like that one. Nice red, pink. Ooh, got sparkly ones as well. For me, it's between this one and this one. I think I'm gonna go with that first one. It's like a nice shade of pink and red mixed together. So that one for sure. And now, are we right thing and hurry up. Oh, we gotta grab her stuff. Okay, a picture of Jack, her keys, her phone, and a birthday card, of course. All things we need. Seal up your backpack. We're good to go. And then what else do we need to do for you now? So we've done makeup. We've got your backpack sorted out. And now we need the cake. cake ever. Oh, we have to make the cake. All right. I thought you already made it, girl. Okay, let's put that. Put some frosting. Put happy birthday on it, of course. Uh, put some fruits on it with some sparkles. Perfect. Now you're ready. You're ready to go. Done. Good. I hope he'll like my cake. Okay, he's gonna love your cake. It's gonna be so nice. <sighs> Jack is gonna break her heart. I cannot believe this. Rule number two, never trust a cheerleader. <gasps> Are we throwing some shade? Oh my gosh. I mean, not all cheerleaders are like that. Calm down. Hey, Phoebe. Is it gonna be Phoebe? Hi, Lisa. Oh, my girl. What are you wearing? Why don't you wear the dress I picked for you? Again, the shade? Why are you disrespecting her? She likes what she's wearing. I spent too much time baking this cake. I didn't have time. Gosh, it's Jack's birthday. You should dress like a superstar to shut other people off, you know? Or she could just be herself, you know? Gosh. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Where's Jack? I need to give him the cake. Duh. All right, where is Jack? I saw him went upstairs 10 minutes ago. Probably in his room. 
That's how you see. This is this is when you should have had a red flag going off in your head. Why is Jack at his party in his room? Okay, see you later. I don't know how I feel about this Phoebe girl. She's cute, but you know, it's kind of rude. Oh, the door is not closed. I can hear Jack's voice. He's in the room. Okay, don't drop the cake though. You could have just told him the cake was downstairs. But he seems to be with another person. Ooh. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's Jack and Barbara. What are they doing? Are they are they kissing? Yes, girl. <gasps> oh my gosh. Lisa, what's going on? Why are you crying? Cause she just caught Jack kissing Barbara? I saw I saw Jack kissing Barbara in in his room. Wow. Wow. Oh my gosh. How could he do that? I have no idea. How could he do that to so such a nice person? I look like a fool. Please help me throw this cake away. I want to go home now. Girl, go throw that cake all over his carpet and then leave. I'm just kidding. Don't do that because his parents might get mad. But yeah, you're right. He doesn't deserve that cake or that nice letter or anything. Where are we going to throw it away? Okay, okay. Do you want me to go with you? Yes. Duh. Oh, fine. No, no thanks. I just want to be alone now. Wow. I just want to give her a hug. It's okay, Lisa. You deserve better, okay? He didn't deserve you. Not if he was willing to do that to you. Okay, I'll call you tomorrow. But when you call me tomorrow, Phoebe, give me all the gossip, okay? <laughs> wow. I just want to smack Jack in the face. But violence is not the answer. Rule number three. Happy ever after is a fairy tale. Aww. She's not going to believe in love anymore. Happy ever after just doesn't exist. Maybe no, it's not true. Too stupid to believe all the fairy tales. No, it's okay for you to believe in these things. That's what that's what that's, that's what love is about. You have to take risks. I feel so bad for her. She's How devastated. Can you do that to me. He's dumb. That's why he did that to you. You deserve so much better. Don't even shed a tear for him. He is not worth it, girl. He is not worth it one bit. All right, I'm just gonna sit here and wipe your face over and over and over and again until you feel better. Don't you worry, okay? There we go. Now let's put some eye drops. Just because she's the cheerleader of the basketball team? Ah! <gasps> wow! No, he didn't choose her because she was better. He chose her because he didn't understand the value of you. Okay? Let's brush your hair. Knew it. Guys always like cheerleaders. No, they don't. Not always. Jack was just rude, okay? That's all there was to Jack. Do anything wrong. No, you didn't. So don't feel bad and don't cry. I feel like Lisa is really my friend right now. There we go. I need a clean face. Yes, you do need a clean face. Because for some reason, your face always ends up dirty no matter what. Is it because you rubbed your eyes with all your eyeliner and stuff? I think it is. Let's wash this off. No more tears, girl, okay? No more tears. Jack is not worth it. Look at you. You're a beautiful, strong woman, all right? You don't need him. Let's go. I have a good rest now. I yeah, cool. Tomorrow everything will be better. Go take a little nap, okay, girl? Rest up. Rule number four. Know when it's time to move on. We are going to move on, and we are going to just get out of here. Morning, Lisa. Morning. I feel really bad today. That's understandable. We know. This is why we're here. We need to change you upside down. <laughs> you will go to school tomorrow and break up with that stupid Jack. Ooh, I like her now. She's sassy. I like it. I don't know. I'm not sure. What do you mean you're not sure? He just cheated on you. You can't stay with him, Lisa. You gotta go. You can't stay with him, Lisa. No, 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 no. Don't worry, girl. You're in the right hands. Trust me. Okay. But you gotta make sure she breaks up with him. First comes first. What happened to your face? Let me see how I can make it right. <laughs> you could have said it in a nicer way. She's feeling really stressed out, which means that could be the reason why she's breaking out. All right. So let's go ahead and clean you up again, girl. All right. Let's go ahead. Oh, first we gotta wash your hair. All right. Let's get the shampoo all over your hair. Make sure you smell good, you know? You really need this much shampoo though? Okay, good. 
Now let's rinse that off. You're just gonna shampoo your hair out here in your bedroom? <laughs> it's like, yeah, I'm just gonna shampoo my hair here. All right, good. Now let's blow dry this bad boy. We're gonna give you a nice blowout so it looks bad. You walk in, it's gonna be like, you're gonna walk in like Beyonce. Your hair is gonna be blowing in the wind. Yes. Good. And now let's wash your face as well. Yeah, if she doesn't have a clean face, it's not gonna help her pimples. So you gotta keep it clean. Wash all that off. Then we gotta rinse that off. What is this? A knife? What happens to your eyebrows? They look oh. like my father's garden. That girl just said her eyebrows look like her dad's garden. That is disrespectful. <laughs> we gotta say her friends keep it really true. Really truthful. Let's pop these. Ugh. And then let's put some ointment on them. So that, you know, it takes away some of the redness and stuff. There we go. And we got one more. Don't worry. There. And now, Relax, let's girl. put a nice mask on. You need some time to yourself. <gasps> oh. Ooh. We're basically giving her a makeover so we could rub it in Jack's face and see like, Yes, Jack, this is what you missed out on. I'm fabulous. All right, so now let first, make it nature. we got to dye her hair. All right, so let's see. What color do we want to choose for her hair? Oh, it's going to get highlights. Oh, girl. Um, If we get highlights, I think I want to go for something that matches her hair already. So it doesn't stand out too, too much. I, mean, I kind of like the blue, to be honest. So we have the yellow one. There's the rainbow one. Ooh, it's tough because I kind of like the way the rainbow one looks. But then if you go with the blonde, you can't really see it that much. So it looks more like natural highlights. Mm, I think I'm going to go with that. And now time for some not harm. makeup, some eyeshadow. All right. So we've got, oh, that's eyeliner. Okay. So we've got brown. Oh, no, oh, these are her eyebrows. Okay. Her eyebrows need to be, hmm. If they're, if I you choose too much of a dark color, it stands out way too much. So let's go. I kind of like that one. Because the reddish brown kind of goes with the inner part of her hair. So that one's good. Your I think this. Are so beautiful. Yes, this is the eyeshadow. All right. We could go with super sparkly. Ooh, that's a nice pink sparkle. I kind of like the pink one, though. The second one we chose? I think it's the second one. That's purple, yellow. Mmm. I think. Mmm. I like this one. I think both look really nice. But we're going to go with that one. And then some blush. Because she doesn't want to look pale. That's what they said. All right. So let's try a subtle pink. Because I don't like when it stands out way too much. That's a nice one. It's always the second ones I like, isn't it? I wish something had like a bit of a, of a brownish tinge. So it could look like a contour. She's going to slay with that contour. That's not bad. Hmm. No, I don't like that one. Let's go with that right there. Perfect. And now, this is cool. What's that? No, we don't want stickers on her face. No, 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 no stickers. She looks all right. But do we have to put a sticker? I think we're gonna have to put a sticker on. Oh my gosh! Right, so I want to go with something a bit darker this time. Something that's really gonna be like boop. You know, is there a red? That's the closest thing to red that we have, and it does look nice. I would go with Sparkle, but she already has the glitter on her eyes, so I don't want to go with too much. There we go. All right, so we have to add a sticker. We have to. <laughs> Fine. I'll put a sticker on her face. All right. I didn't want to, but if we have to. Girl, you look like you're about to go to Coachella or something. All right, so let's go with the smallest thing possible, which is the heart. Could do some butterflies. For me, it's between the butterflies and the, I think the sun looks real cool. It looks like I'm going to go with the sun because the sun makes it look kind of like... You know where they have like the tattoos, the, the, the gold ones? That's what it reminds me of. So we're going to go with that. Oh my God, I can't believe this. I look like another person now. You, well, Thank you look... so much, girls. You look... You're welcome. You look real good, though, girl. We did a good job on you. Rule number five. It's never too late to be a cool girl. You... Lisa, please don't disappoint me. You don't have to change for him. He was a jerk who didn't deserve you. We need something cool for the school uniform. Okay, like what? But she can't choose anything cool. It's a school uniform. She has to follow the rules. 
All right. We're, oh, oh, we're gonna we're gonna switch up her uniform. We're gonna make it look fabulous. Okay. Get the size right. All right. We'll take her measurements. Yes. Correct. Yep. Now that one. There. Waist. Hips. Perfect. Why do? Oh, we need her height. There we go. Did they remove all my makeup? I think they did. Oh my gosh. All right. Let's Which go ahead. Which style do you like? Ooh, it's just a school uniform. If not, like I really would like the top left, but I feel like because it's just school, let's let's try it though. Let's try it first and see. Cause that's nice. Yeah, cause it's gonna show off her figure, you know. This is different. What are we doing with both? Okay, here we go. So we're gonna put that there. Ooh, you look. Where does that go? Oh, that that's uh, that's a little bow tie. I like that choice. That was actually a really good choice. And now let's put. You're gonna wear high heels to school? That sounds. That seems like it's gonna be a little painful. I'm not even gonna lie to you. All right. So we need something that's gonna match her outfit. So I'm thinking something like those are nice. Those heels are nice. Those are nice as well. They're not bad. I don't really like those. I think for me it's between. Whoa. For me it's between the pink ones, like the pink ones and the reddish ones. We're gonna go with those. They're classic. Now you need some jewelry, some accessories. You're not gonna really be able to see it that well because of the shirt she's wearing. It's ha quite high up, but we'll put something on her anyway. Um, ooh. We'll go with that one, even though it kind of messes with her bow. We'll go with that one. I like now, this. some earrings and that is it. I wanna do some like little studs. Something that goes with her necklace, though, and the rest of her outfit. Oh, those are really cute. Those are cute because they they have a little, you won't be able to see it, but they have like a little pink pearl in them. So that's going to go with her shoes. Got her earrings done. We got her outfit. She looks and feels fabulous. But the most important thing is that she feels fabulous. Wow, is this me? Cannot believe this. You should, girl. You should believe it. That is you. This is what we're talking about. You have to be confident. Show Jack what he's missing. You look so great, Jack will regret it. I guarantee you. Yes, and he doesn't deserve you. Go and break up with him, girl. You need to. Thank you for speaking. I like her face. She's like. <laughs> All right, so this is the moment we're going to break up with Jack. She feels good, and that's what's important. So let's go. I'm ready. Rule number six, no and goodbye. Ooh. The sassy's real. Oh. Hey, Lisa. Didn't see you for two days. Where have you been? Where do you think she's been, Jack? She's been watching you make out with Barbara. Huh. Where did I go? It's none of your business. At least not anymore. Ooh. Jack, just letting you know, I'm not your girlfriend anymore. Are you breaking up with me? You heard it right, Jack. Yes, I'm breaking up with you. You can go find Barbara now. Best wishes and good bye. <laughs> she is so sassy. I love it. Good for you, Lisa. Good for you. I hope one day you find someone that treats you better. Lisa's going to have a new life now. A life without Jack. Everything is new, new, new. What suggestions will Lisa get from her BFFs later? The biggest opportunity is waiting for Lisa and a new guy. Stay tuned to our next app. Are they going to make another one? Oh my gosh. I hope they do because I kind of want to see where Lisa goes from here. I hope, I really, really hope they don't have her just get in another relationship because they should show Lisa and all the girls out there that they don't need to get in a relationship to be happy. Like how good would it be to see Lisa and her best friends just go and have fun? Mm -hmm. And then watch Jet burn. I'm just kidding. That's a bit too dark. Okay, let me stop. But hopefully they make another app for it. I'll definitely keep my eye out for it. If they do, would you guys want to see a part two if they do make one? I'm not sure if they are. I'll have a link to it down in the description below if you guys want to check it out. It was a ton of fun. I really, really enjoyed it. It's probably one of the best apps I've played. Not the best, but one of the best. Really, really enjoyed it. I hope you guys had fun watching. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and share. Let me know what other apps, games you would like me to play next. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!